This video was made possible by the good folks at Next Level Racing. To purchase a cockpit setup like mine or any other Next Level Racing products, check out nextlevelracing.com. What's up guys, it's Mike for Sim Racing 604 and today I'm going to be talking to you about version 1.0.7 of Assetto Corsa Competizione. The change log is huge, but uh, most notable probably and the most interesting to most of us is the new five point tire model. So it's it's quite intricate and I will link in the description to a great article about exactly what the five point tire model is, but basically they have added more sampling areas for the tire to change the grip levels. So a lot of us had complaints about the curbs, especially at Spa in Assetto Corsa Competizione to date. Sometimes you'd go over a curb that you could previously hit in Assetto Corsa or you could hit it pretty aggressively in some other sims, but in ACC you end up spinning out. It was just kind of like, why is this happening? Well, ACC, excuse me, Kunos has addressed that with ACC. And um, if you're looking for just the quick answer here of does it make a difference, uh, uh, yes, it absolutely makes a difference 1.0.7 is fantastic i am back just absolutely loving acc it feels awesome um, so what we're going to do here first things first i'm going to show you how to access 1.0.7 because it's not an official update yet uh, it's still a public beta but it's easy enough to opt into the public beta and just fair warning uh, it is a beta program so there might be bugs that kunos has not yet worked out so if there are bugs in 1.0.7 that are really bothering you, you can revert back to the original version. But uh, here it is, just a quick guide on how to install 1.0.7, and then we'll jump onto the track and uh, actually test out these curbs, and you'll see how aggressively I can take them. All right, enjoy. Okay, guys, so getting the beta version 1.0.7 or any other beta version in the future, um, what you do is right click from Steam on your Assetto Corsa Competizione, choose Properties, and in the Properties window you're going to choose the Betas tab, and as you can see there's, uh, well actually I've enabled it before, but let's say you are in None, which should be yours by default, you're going to enter ACC Beta with a capital B, B-E-T-A, and then branch, as in branch of a tree also with a capital B. Then it's going to, you're gonna ask it to check the code, and now you should have a public beta in your dropdown. Choose it, choose close, and you can see on the bottom there that it is downloading an update, and uh, it's going to figure out what it needs to download, and then you will be running the beta version. And if you choose to, uh, if you choose that the beta version is not something you want in the future, what you can do is actually go back to your game properties again, betas, and then just choose the version that you want. If you choose none, it's the public release, the full tested public release. If you choose the public beta, it will be the latest version. And you can check on the Assetto Corsa uh, Kunos forums for that uh, to see what the latest beta version is and that is it shouldn't take too too long so let's go ahead and jump out on track okay guys so getting set for the green flag here at spa just gonna do a short little three lap race official timing is five minutes we might only get two laps in i'm not sure starting in tenth of twenty positions Aggressive on the curbs there, caught a little bit of grass. That's not a great test of Eau Rouge. I was still going uh, pretty slow there as we were just starting the race. Got a little bit of a gap here. Should be able to be somewhat aggressive on these curbs. As you can see, you heard the curbing there, you saw the car go over it, and uh, no real adverse effects, which is great. You can still definitely feel the curb. Um, I have done, I did about an hour's worth of practice on these uh, new curbs, the 1.0.7 curbs, or tire model, better stated. And um, I can tell you, the curbs can still upset the car but you really have to be pushing excessively hard. It's not so sensitive like it was before. We'll see it here too. 
aggressive on the inside. It did uh, slightly upset the car there, but you can see, like, I can still push through that corner. That's so much better. It feels so good. I'm really glad they made this change. Well done to Kunos. I've always felt this was a really great feeling uh, sim, and now uh, we're back to that. It seemed to get away from it for a bit with a few of the earlier builds, but uh, this one feels really great. Right up onto the tail of this Lambo. Oh, geez. Mercedes. Oh, hurt my safety rating. That's okay. Safety rating isn't great as <laughs> to begin with. Now, I can't help but feel there will be a CPU hit to this uh, five-point tire model. But we'll see how that plays out. So you saw I pushed a little bit too hard there, but uh, managed to hold on to it. That wasn't a great line through all Rouge. Hopefully, we'll get to try it one more time. But regardless, I think you guys get the picture here. I'll brake hard and uh, hit the curb on the inside here, and you'll see. And I totally missed it. Better example right there. So huge improvement. And I'm so glad to have this. It's nice to be able to take those curbs aggressively once again. It's probably the best example of those curbs. And yeah, no problem. My CPU is just getting destroyed right now, but that's okay. It's a bit much to ask it to uh, record while doing ACC with the new five-point model in a 20-car race. But that's a subject for another time. Right now, I'm just very happy. I think they've really done a great job with this new five-point tire model. Feels awesome. Uh, really one of the best feeling sims, in my opinion, available. And you can once again safely finish laps, so. Okay, the leader is on the final lap now. Give it all you can. All right, we'll get one more. I'll try and uh, clean it up through Al Rouge this time. Might be a bit difficult in traffic, but we'll see what we can do. Bit late on the gas there, that's okay. And for those wondering, I'm running the uh, stock safe setup. Oh, so much better, so much better. Could use a bit of work on the line, but regardless, I hit the curbs pretty hard and uh, little to no ill effects from hitting those curbs. That's great, that's fantastic. Safe rejoin. All right, so we'll finish this lap and that'll be it. But really just a, a tremendous update. Very happy to have this. ACC has once again become king of GT3, in my opinion. And 
try and sneak by this J or this Lexus. What am I saying? Saw the Emil Fry, and I made an assumption. I assumed your manufacturer. That's a microaggression. I shouldn't have done that. Brilliant. Brilliant. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, yeah, let me know if you have any questions about the install, but I think you will like 1.0.7. Thanks for watching.